Kiss with a 5.3 and 1340. We're hip hop and RB live the day party with your favorite DJ, DJ D Sewell. Y'all, let's discuss some hip hop news now. It is time for D Sewell. What the hell happened today? And a lot of stuff happened today. Y'all, Jack Harlow announced he is dropping a new project and it's coming out this Friday. The name of the project is Jack Man. Now, that don't sound like a project that's going to be bumping, but that's the name of it, y'all. Well, uh, last year, he dropped a project. It was called uh, Come Home, The Kids Miss You. Now, last year, he had a whole different energy when he was getting ready to drop. He was coming off the big hit with Lil Nas X, Industry Baby. Then uh, he had the hit of his own, First Class. So he dropped that project. It did really, really well. Right now, it's not a lot of hits that he got out. And he ain't really got no momentum. So we'll see how this project sounds Friday. Yeah, we got to talk about NLE Chopper. He has a lot of motion right now. And the first week numbers are in for his new project. The name of that project is Cottonwood 2. And it looks to move around 23,000 units. Is that a win or a flop for NLE Chopper? I'm giving it a sort of win. It's not a flop. If he was in the low 10,000s, it would be a flop. But uh, he's still relevant, and his song SMO is really, really hidden right now. And he actually just dropped a remix to that song on OnlyFans. NLE Chopper said he's the first rapper to drop a song on OnlyFans. So what time for NLE Chopper? Y'all, in other news, we got to show some props to SZA. She earns the first number one of her career. Now, her album has been number one. It was number one for like nine weeks. But her song Kill Bill makes her first official number one on the Billboard charts so one time for SZA and she also just released the remix of that song Kill Bill featuring Doja Cat. Y'all Jim Jones, Fabulous, Mano and Dave East are teaming up and working on a gym inspired album called Fit Lit. Do you want to hear that project or not, y'all? They dropped the song last year. It was called Fit Lit, so they just gonna put together a whole project. You know what I'm saying? Something to help you out in the gym. Help you get it right. You know what I'm saying? Get it right and tight. You can listen to some Jim Jones, Fabulous, Mano, and Dave East. Y'all, another news, Kid Cudi to star in and produce a new zombie movie. Kid Cudi's new film will be called Hell No. Kid Cudi will produce the film through his production company called Mad Soul he said, you'll laugh and also be shook. Kid Cudi, we gon' see. Now, Kid Cudi did release an album and like a movie to go along with that album last year on Netflix called Intergalactic. I did not get a chance to check it out, but people did say that the uh, film was good. It was an animated film, but it had good reviews on it. So we'll see if he can come back with another good movie. Y'all, last but not least, Benny the Butcher. He is here with a new project. The name of it is Everybody Can't Go. He gave us the release date. It's coming out August 11th. If that date sounds kind of familiar. August 11th is the 50th birth date of hip-hop. So one time for Benny the Butcher. And y'all, he hasn't dropped since 2022's Tana Talk 4. And uh, this project will be executive produced by Hit Boy. So it should be plenty bangers on that thing. Y'all, that is what the hell happened today. I'll be back tomorrow, 2 p.m. sharp right here on Kiss. 105.3, 1940.